Hey everybody, this is Keith Hipple and I'm the co-founder and CEO of Spring. And we partner with Lyft on Vancouver Island to help island entrepreneurs to launch, grow and change the world. And what I wanna do is talk today about the merger of two different types of entrepreneurs into the new reality. And over the last, especially 20 years, a lot of people have been saying, hey, I'm a tech entrepreneur, or hey, I'm a food entrepreneur. And there was a belief that those two worlds didn't meet. So the, the classic world of bricks and mortar and the classic or this newer world of tech. And so the reality is, is that tech entrepreneurship is dead long live entrepreneurship. And the reason for that is technology is pervasive. It implies and it impacts everything that we do in society today as people and as businesses, but technology is tools in a toolbox. So whether you are running an AI company or you're doing augmented or virtual reality, um, you're actually solving a problem for a consumer. The consumer is not buying the technology, they're buying the benefits of the technology. If I'm running a pottery business in Campbell River, people are buying my pottery. Now they might be doing it off of my website, they might be doing it in e-commerce, they might be doing it on Amazon, but I'm still selling pottery, I'm providing benefits to the business. So what we wanna do as entrepreneurs is realize that we're not separated. Whether I'm running a software business, a hardware business, a pottery business, or a consulting business, we're all entrepreneurs, we're actually all trying to solve a customer's problem, and ultimately we all pull technology out of the toolbox to empower us to do it, and we can all help each other to overcome barriers, seize opportunities, grow our business, and change the world. So let's stop talking about tech entrepreneurships or non-tech entrepreneurships, let's talk about entrepreneurships and making an impact.